Good day. This is Peter Kniff from Castlestone Management with comments on the U.S. markets for the week ending October 22nd. U.S. stocks recorded a near 5% weekly gain as investors pondered a Wall Street Journal story that the Fed might move to smaller rate hikes as soon as December. The Dow Jones climbed 4.9% to 31,082.56. The S&P rose 4.7% to 3,752.75, and the NASDAQ Composite advanced 5.2% to 10,859.72. Treasury yields were mixed this week on a story that the Fed was open to debating the size of the December rate hike. The two-year note yield fell 1.8 basis points on the week, its largest weekly drop since July. However, the 10-year note climbed 20.7 basis points, and the 30-year bond yield rose 32.9 basis points over the five trading sessions. The 30-year yield now sits near an 11-year high. The resignation of UK Prime Minister Liz Truss, rumors of a BOJ yen intervention, and a report of a potentially less hawkish Fed helped the U.S. dollar index post a loss for the week. Gold may be losing its luster as a haven, with the yellow metal hitting its lowest level in two and a half years Friday before bouncing to post a half a percent gain on the week. U.S. oil prices posted gains on the week with WTI up five tenths of percent, Brent up two percent, but the real action in the commodity markets came in natural gas. Natural gas prices fell 23 percent for the week as concerns of supply constraints created by the Russian invasion of Ukraine have faded. Thanks for listening. Thanks for doing business with Castlestone, and we'll talk to you soon.